I am Matthew Kelly. Welcome back to Radical and Irrelevant, where each day we take a couple of minutes to anchor our day in the gospel. Today's reading is from Matthew chapter 10, verses 24 through 33. A disciple is not above his teacher, nor a servant above his master. It is enough for the disciples to be like his teacher and for the servant to be like his master. If they have called the master of the house Beelzebub, how much more will they malign those of his household? So have no fear of them, for nothing is covered that will not be revealed or hidden that will not be known. When I tell you in the dark, utter in the light, and what you hear whispered, proclaim upon the housetops. And do not fear those who kill the body, but cannot kill the soul. Rather fear him who can destroy both soul and body in hell. Are not two sparrows sold for a penny? And not one of them will fall to the ground without your father's will. But even the hairs on your head are all numbered. Fear not, therefore. You are of more value than many sparrows. So everyone who acknowledges me before men, I will acknowledge him before my Father who is in heaven. But whoever denies me before men, I will deny before my Father who is in heaven. What jumps out at you today? Jumps out at me is just two words, your Father's will. So this is the constant battle we have in, in the spiritual journey is we want to do what we want to do. We want to assert our will. And the gospel is a, is a constant invitation to surrender to God's plans, to God's will, to God's desires. And we revolt against that. We rebel against that. And sometimes it's in big ways and sometimes it's in small ways. But each day is a call back to realign ourselves with the will of God. What is God's will for you today? What is your will for you today? Where is the conflict? Where are they clashing? And will you make that surrender? Maybe a small surrender, maybe a great surrender, but it's a constant invitation to surrender. Have a great day. Remember, be bold, be Catholic.